girls, what are you doing just sitting about? Oh, well, Olivia's not sitting about, she's mucking about. We don't have time for this. Welcome to LEV Toys. We have got to finish building the Lego Friends Heart Lake City Resort and there is no time to be messing about. So the girls are back here. We are up to bag number five. If you missed the first part of this build, make sure you check it out because whoa, there's so much good stuff that we've already built. But there's so much to still be built, so let's do this. We're up to the next floor or the next room, and I'm not quite certain what it is. We've already built two little accommodation rooms, so two little rooms. They're tiny, they're teeny tiny. Now, this doesn't look like a room yet. This looks like we have got a little lounge suite to sit on. It's very tropical, perfect for a resort, a beach resort, and it's, it's pretty. It's very pretty and it looks very comfy. Andrea's trying it out for us and we are building what looks like a matching one, maybe. It's starting the same. And we're putting the same sticker on, so matching, a matching common living area or a place to go. On. Oh, a lounge, a place to go and hang out. That's really cool. So Olivia's gonna try this one out for comfort. She says that one's really comfortable and they go over here, so on the outsides, Oh, that's a bit far apart from each other if you want to chat. Hello across the room there. Hopefully they can hear each other. Hopefully it's not going to be a noisy room. Let's see what else goes into it. I don't know what this is, but we're turning it around and we're working back inside the room now. And this looks like it might be, oh, it's a tabletop of some sort. We've got a cup and we've got a plate and a little, oh, a little coffee machine. <laughs> yes, definitely a spot where you can come and have some afternoon tea or some snacks. In fact, this looks like it might be a fruit smoothie maker. Watermelon in there, some sort of random red stuff and some green grapes so they can make their own smoothies or they can have a cup of coffee and they can have some healthy fruit too if they want to. There's a banana there and a pineapple. Oh, that's nice. This is a nice place to hang out. There's, somebody's left their mobile phone over there and there's a cup over here. So somebody's already tried out the amenities and they think it's delicious. <laughs> Back on the outside, there's some, oh, I've never seen these massive triangle pieces, but they have got some very pretty stickers on them. So that's going to be on the front facing part of the resort. It's gonna look really spectacular. This is such a, an interesting design. We've got some clips up here. And some bendy bits to make a semicircle. Yeah, make a semicircle. We're gonna be making a design here. Oh, I like the see-through bar in the middle there as well. Oh, it's so the, the, the air, it's all open. It's gonna be so breezy in here. <laughs> if that's what they want it to be. <laughs> that's what it's definitely going to be. It's a heart shape. I just realized that those arches made that into a heart shape. Oh, that's so cool. That's super cool. In fact, our bendy bits here are now going to accentuate the heart so that we can't miss it at all. <laughs> Even if you're me and you miss things obvious like that when they come up. We've got some speakers now. So what are these going to attach to? Oh, these might be, these might be blaring out the wonderful sounds that are coming from Andrea's music area that we built right back at the beginning. And that's going to go on the very top of the resort and the speakers are going to pick up that music and they're going to, they're going to blast it out to everybody in the beach. And this is some more, well, just some more. Looks like decoration. Definitely decoration with dolphins and seashells. I don't think there's any doubting that we are here at the beach. This goes up here right on top of the check-in area. Uh, but, yep, there we go. I've got, a, got that on properly now. That's cool. And we're up to bag number six. And we can actually take that room off quite easily. This is getting very exciting. In fact, the girls are having too much fun playing already. Mason's there at the top of the paraglider. <laughs> They're not helping me at all. I'm doing all the jobs, kiddos. This is, this is supposed to be your resort and I'm doing all the work. I don't mind. I like doing all the work, <laughs> especially when it's Lego. They can keep playing. Now, what do we have in our next room? Looks like a... Looks like a bathroom, there's toilet roll. Oh, I like to see the sunscreen there. That is gonna be super important. You need to be sun smart if you are out in the sun. Slather that sunscreen on, make sure you cover up and just protect your skin from the sun. So important, this is definitely a bathroom. Got a sink, we've got a tap and we've got a teeny tiny toilet. 
It's all teeny tiny in here, but that's okay because the Lego Friends girls are teeny tiny too. That's lots of alliteration with ta 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 Okay. Uh, okay, so in the bathroom, it's kind of like a change room or maybe a rinse-off room. So you're going to be, well, no, not a rinse-off room because there's no shower in it. So it's definitely the toilet because did you notice there are no toilets in their rooms? So they're going to have to come down here to the communal toilet if they need to, uh, well, if they need to go to the toilet, obviously. <laughs> but they're on holiday. Surely they don't need to go to the toilet on holiday. Don't all toilet things get cancelled when you're on holidays? That's ridiculous. What am I saying? All right, we have extended out our floor plan here. You need to go to the toilet all the time. Bodily functions do not stop at any stage. <laughs> extending our floor out. It looks like we've put some water on. So maybe this is extending out into the sand. It definitely looks like sand. We're down on the beach now. This is cool. And we've got kind of a little pedestal. Got some open areas happening now. We're building up some pillars and some more sand here i think maybe a little oh more water more water onto the sand that's a smooth slippery bit so it's going to be some slippery water off the sand oh i'm excited to see what this is going to be and another little pillar mm, and we've got a platform up here on the second level and a spinny thing i still have no idea what's going on <laughs> <laughs> um, it will all be revealed as we keep building. Oh, okay, so this has got a life roundy thing on it. I'm sure I remember what that's called. And a walkie-talkie and some binoculars. So this is going to be a lifeguard's little high posty thing. Lifeguard's chair. So they can sit up high and they can keep an eye on what's happening in the water. We're going to give Mason that job because Mason, I think, is in charge here. So... We'll make sure that he actually does some jobs. And there's a slide! The first of the slides! Oh, this is exciting. And another slide! Oh my goodness, the slides are coming thick and fast. Now we've got blue slides here. All the way down into the water. That's what we're seeing. So the slides are on the beach from the resort going into the water. <laughs> yes, that's so much fun. We're up on the second level. Let's see how high this water slide goes how high the water park goes. Oh, so green and red, so that people know when they can go down the slides, so that the, the, they, the people down the bottom have had time to clear, so it's safe for you to go down. This is cool, and we've got an archway to go through. Yay! Oh, Olivia's going super slow because her hair is slowing her down. That's the only, <laughs> only problem with these rubbery mini doll hair pieces, is that they, well, they don't slide very well. What do we got here? We've got another, might be an, Oh, oh, okay, we've made some railings for safety up here on the next level. Ah, uh, that goes out here. Well, that's just hanging out on the end. Oh, <laughs> we're going up really high. Oh, it's a twisty, turny pink slide. Oh, wow, that's why we need the railings, because you really don't want to be falling off that. Though they go down the slides so slowly that it's not really very unsafe at all. And Andrea's gone down too. They've all had a go and they all went down really slowly because their hair slowed them down. We'll put this plant in here and I think, oh, you can climb up the plant to go down the slides. Don't think that's how you're supposed to do it. Actually, there are no stairs and there's no ladder, so they're just going to have to fly. Look, Mason went down fine. <laughs> Goes Olivia really slowly. We're up to bag number seven. <laughs> well, we've got the water slide. Let's see what we have next. We've got another, uh, okay, we've got another green and red light. And we've got our little sign which tells us this is a water park. So that goes up here near the top. And over here we've got some more pillars. And I'm not certain what's happening here. We've got something that's going to move. Something on a bit of a twisty, turny, hingy thing. Oh, it's a bucket. It's a bucket to dump some water down on the slide below. So we put our little blue water pieces in. And when we drop it down, can we drop it down? Let's do it. Oh, they actually hit the slide quite low. And then they <laughs> just scatter out onto the floor. But that's to depict the water going down and to make the slide all wet so that it's slippery and it's much more fun. <laughs> or you can have fun just dumping it on the head of whoever's actually going down the slide at the time. Now that seems to be tilting backwards and in the picture in the instructions it sits up straight. I'll have a bit of an investigator that later. Let's keep building and I'll come back to the bucket after I've gone back to have another look at the instructions because it 
it should look the way it does in the instructions. At the moment, even though it functions perfectly, it should be sitting up straight. Now we have headed up super duper high. Our next sticker is for our, uh, our bucket tipping on slide. So each different slide gets its own little sign. And we've got some, we've definitely hit the top. We've got those rounded over pieces and we've got a clamshell, which is the mirror image of our dolphin sticker on the other side. So this is the very opposite side of the resort. And it looks like we've got it all done. Oh, look at that. And it, the hinged pieces mean that we can kind of slant it in and out. That's really cool, but we're not finished. We're not finished at all. We've got to build the monorail. Monorail, let's build the monorail and let's put it together and let's play with it. I'm so excited by this monorail. I actually have got the roller coaster ordered and it hasn't come yet. And I really want to play with these new roller coaster pieces, which in this case are making us a monorail. So let's build this monorail. Let's get excited. So the monorail is going to take it from one side of the resort to the other. We need these pillars here to support it. So we need five of them. Cool. Let's see how this goes. So this one bends out and this one also circles around. This is so simple. And this one, next one is going to bend outwards. Oh, hold on. It's not overly secure our monorail yet. It's not safe for monorailing on and all the way out here. Goodness, this has got quite a footprint now <laughs> with the monorail on. And this one connects back up with the resort where? Let me see. Oh, over here, I see a, I see an, a convenient hole to stick the little plug into. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's, that's it. The monorail goes straight from their rooms around to the water park. So we need to put these little gray square flat pieces in on each of these connecting points. So it keeps them extra secure. And now we just need to build the vehicle that goes on the monorail. We've got these new super duper little wheels. This is an, this is all new for me. This is very exciting. A new little fixed piece. And it looks like we can make, we can join up several little little carriages here, but we've only got a single one for our monorail, which is sensible because it's not a very long, <laughs> not a very long track to go along. This is really, really exciting. Let's see. Oh, check it out. It's powered by solar. So it's solar powered on the top. <gasps> Perfect. That's good because they get so much sun here. It's a beach resort. You need to make do with the power sources that you have readily and plentifully supplied. This here is just, I have no idea what that is. That one's just, maybe that's just random buttons that you can push and maybe they play nice music while you're inside. But on the other side, the other side, hopefully we'll have something a bit more informative. We've got a red pokey out a bit there. We didn't have that on the other side so we're not quite a mirror image okay so this is going to tell us or maybe we we designate where we want to stop so over at the water park or in the middle where you check in or on the this triple z side where you <laughs> triple z's where you go for your sleepies back at the back at the rooms at the accommodation so you can tell it where you want to go and i've done something wrong here oh i've missed out the white triangle no wonder it doesn't fit properly i was too excited let's put that on now we're perfect doesn't sit on there flat, but let's put Stephanie in. She can be our, our passenger for the maiden voyage of the monorail. Monorail, let's do it. Monorail, there it goes. Oh, it's so sedate and stately. <laughs> That's, it's awesome. That's so cool. Stephanie, you've had a go. It's time for Olivia to hop in and have a go. She can ride it back to the apartments. There we Oh, they could do this all day. And Andrea is waiting very impatiently for her turn. It's Andrea's turn. There is only room in here. We <laughs> for one mini doll at a time. So they're just going to have to take turns, which they're fine at. Now, at the very top of the resort, this is where the, well, this is the party floor. This is where the DJ, DJ station is. So it's right at the top. There's one more thing to build. This is right at the end of the build. It's such a, an interesting little addition. It is, uh, is it a jet ski? No, 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 it's not a jet ski. It's not a little surfboardy thing. It's actually for the water slide. Look, that's so great. It means 
they can go down oh face forward I could do this all day and that's it, it it means that they don't stick like we were seeing with their hair sticking now let's fix this bucket we actually need this to go around the other way look it was simple as that and now the bucket sits upright see it was such a simple fix all right it's time to play with it Olivia got here first and she's waiting for Andrea and Stephanie who are here Stephanie's got a brand new bag she's really excited about that they can't see Mason anywhere so Olivia's just going to check them in grab the keys take them up to their rooms all right are we going come on follow Olivia come on let's go no not that way Andrea that way yep yep all right that's good she knows where she's going now. So this teeny tiny room here is yours and the purple room upstairs, also teeny tiny, is for you, Stephanie. You're going to have to back in with that really enormous suitcase. I don't know where you're going to put it. Oh, okay, but she's all settled in. They're ready to go and have some fun. So a few snacks first. I think they've seen Mason. Oh, there he is. He's paragliding. Now, hold on a minute. If he's up there, who's driving the boat? Oh, the dolphin's driving the boat. Oh, wow, Sheen. Wow, 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 that dolphin is multi-talented. Mason has come to greet the new guests here at the resort. And oh, so has Sheen. Sheen loves to meet new people. Right, uh, they're taking the monorail over to the water park. Oh, but hold on, girls, there is not enough room there for... Well, you cannot all fit on the... Oh, okay, I stand corrected. Apparently you can all fit on the monorail at the same time. <laughs> right, water park time. Let's use this new front floaty slidey thing because it's awesome. It's so good. And Stephanie's about to pour some water down Olivia, but she's still stuck. We might help her along. There we go. Water park is spectacular. Now for a few drinks while... Oh, hold on. What is Stephanie doing? Oh, no, no. Hold on. Now Sheen's going past and they're just mucking about on this monorail. That is not what it's for. It is not a toy. <laughs> they're having a bit of a rest in their rooms before they have a big party tonight. Oh, it's good to have some... Oh, except for Olivia, who is paragliding. Right, she never stops. <laughs> but now it is party time. Actually, let's take this party down under the beach. That is such a great idea. Let's do this. Andrea is doing her DJ thing. Everybody is here. Let's bring the couches out. Let's make this super comfortable and super fun. And you can, of course, you can do water sports while you are partying. That is the point of a beach resort. <laughs> Well, we're going to leave them here having an absolute blast because it's time for us to go. But before you go, make sure you click that like button and leave me a comment because I really like to hear what you think about these sets. Make sure you've subscribed if you haven't done it already and click the little notification bell. And I'll be back with a new video really soon. Bye.